the fear of missing out, right? The fear of missing out. You can't get it. Some people can't get in the car. It's it's more addictive or just as addictive as to the person who's smoking. You get in the car, start the car, start driving, grab the phone. You get on the elevator. Matter of fact, if you do it today, you're going to laugh. You get on the elevator, instead of just hitting the button, riding the elevator, you get on the elevator and go straight here and wait on the elevator to stop. Yes, yes or no? Yes, yes or no, right? Fear of missing out. It gives you peer pressure, right? You missing out and find, man, I ain't been on in a while. Let me see who, who went on my page. Give you that validation. Comparison. Look, on Facebook, what a lot of us don't know, some of us have been on Facebook forever, so it's probably changed a thousand times. On Facebook, as you signing up for an account, you have to scroll. It's a lot of fine print. We never, we never read it because we're just trying to get to this post, right? But in that fine print, Facebook actually has these words. It says, to combat social media addiction. This is Facebook. It says this. I should have put a screenshot up so y'all believe me. To combat social media addiction, it's important to be mindful of your usage, set limits, and consider taking breaks to regain control. He telling you, you're going to get on here, my boy, and get out of control. They told you that. So you can't sue them for being addicted. They give you the warning, right? 